Rouge around the wing. Bowls to Clark for 99 and he comes forward. And there it is. He punches it away through the onside. That's a very good 100 for the Australian captain. In Australia, cricket is summer. Cricket at the beach, cricket on Christmas Day, backyard, in the street. As soon as the weather turns, the stumps come out. Kids everywhere are picking up bats, taping tennis balls one half. There are cricket balls thudding into Willow at your local school, at your local park. And on a Saturday afternoon, you can be quietly wandering the streets, and from summer, there'll be a, how's that? Cricket was summer for us. I just remember, I'd be waiting for my older brothers to come home from school, and we'd just play in the backyard. Every Saturday morning, the first thing I'd do, I'd run out and open the windows to make sure that there was sunlight. Every time I smell the cut grass, it takes me way back to my first games of cricket. We had a lot of kids in our neighbourhood that we always play down the street with the wheelie bins. No one was ever out when they were batting, that's for sure. I'd field most weeks, bat at 11, wooden bowl but loved it. It's the sound, it's the sight, it's the heart of summer in Australia. happened to Australia over recent months and post Cape Town. Are you expecting to meet a different sort of side that play differently? And do you think for that reason they could be vulnerable? I, I personally don't think any Australian side is uh, vulnerable at home. Whatever happened, regardless of all the things that have gone by, the skill level is still there. We're definitely not taking anything for granted. We're not even expecting them to play in a certain manner. Our focus is purely on our team. Obviously, there are, there are going to be times when you have to put the batsmen under pressure, not necessarily crossing the line, but just get into their heads, which you expect from any side in the world, not just Australia, but I think a bit of banter there is not harmful at all. Thank you, guys. Virat Kohli, superstar of the game. He averages above 50 in every single form of the game. Nobody is that good across all three forms as Virat Kohli. Virat Kohli is at the pinnacle of his form in the last two years at the pinnacle of world cricket as well. And he's done everything that's needed to become arguably the best player in the world. India is such a big country, so popular over there that he's he's become a bit of a global superstar. Wherever he goes, there's just people, we did, they're just around him. Outstanding player. Uh, probably the best player in the world at the moment. Well, I just remember watching him in the nets. Um, they put that footage out pre-series and he was absolutely smacking them. And I was, I was sort of sitting there thinking, how are we going to get this bloke out? And mum, being mum, just said, oh, he's only, he's only another person. And I said, oh, OK, mum, thanks. That's good advice. It's going to help us get him out, isn't it?